What's going on, guys? It's the men's hub. Now, today I have an insightful video. This is the video that I feel like a lot of men, if you can attract women, especially if you're black, bro, I feel like, bro, you need to know and understand whether a woman's using you just for sex or she actually fucks for you heavy on a different level. Because, bro, like, yeah, a lot of people, a lot of men right now that have never got plays or never got the cheeks, they will think, damn, I wish women just use me, use me for sex. That sounds fun. But you got to understand, some of us, we actually want to have a long-term and a real relationship. And you want to, like, start a family one day. And you, you, you're you past the stage of just, oh, yeah, I feel like I'm the cool kid because I fucked 10 bitches this month. you got to understand, a lot of men, they grow past the stage of just wanting to hit random women for no reason. You realise after the feeling, you're back to square one. You're back to, okay, what's the next bitch I'm going to put my dick in? It's literally, that's why, bro, I talk about no fat retention because, bro, it stops you from chasing that feeling. But, yeah, as you can see by the title, this is a video where it's titled How to Tell If She's Just Using You For Sex As A Handsome Man. Now, you got to understand this can apply to any man. you got to understand, but I feel like mainly for black guys, bro. And if you are not a black guy, it can still relate, but I don't know. I'm speaking from experience, right? Like, bro, and especially, bro, if you date outside the race, you have to be more aware of this, like... At the end of the day, sometimes I really felt like, damn. When I was talking to some snow bunnies, I really felt like, damn, like, she just literally used me for an experience, bro. She literally seen me as an object. She was lusting over me. And she didn't really want nothing serious. She just wanted to get this, this dick. And it's like, it, it, it sounds cool. Like, oh, yeah, you got to fuck, though. But you got to understand, I gave I gave my dick to someone that didn't have no value in my life, bro. You start thinking more philosophical when you actually have knowledge on life. You realize, like, all these feelings of me giving my dick to a random bitch every day, bro, she's benefiting more than I am. Your own, the only way men benefit more than they do is when they're, when when a boys and they think, oh, yeah, just having sex with an older random woman. That's, that's, that's the thing that everyone deems you to be a champion for but with that without with that being said let's just get into it right how to tell if she's using you for sex or not you gotta understand bro if a woman dms you first it could mean she like you but it's a big chance she's just she's just seeing your pictures she's just seeing and there's nothing wrong with that but you have to understand i just don't trust the woman that makes the first move bro like nine times out of ten it never works out like if you're a man that's looking for some long-term shit like nine times out of ten bro a woman that makes the first move on you it, it rarely it kind of goes downhill it kind of goes downhill now not only in this video i'm going to tell you the science that she's just using for sex i'm going to tell you how to actually counter act that bullshit all right now another sign she's just using you for sex bro is that, bro, the only thing she knows how to talk about on the phone is literally, damn, what's your favorite position? Um, How many girls you fuck? What's your body count? Like, a lot of that shit, bro, when when a woman really loves you, bro, it's rare she'll ask about your body count. She don't really give a fuck about that. Like, why the fuck is my body count important? What type of stupid question is that? Like, we're grown here. Why the fuck are you asking me about my past body count? Like, that shit don't mean nothing to me. I never answer that question. Somehow I always escape that question. When they be talking about what's your body count, I'm thinking that's such an immature question. You're clearly, you clearly have your mind focused on sex too much. Now, on the other hand, don't get it twisted. I don't ask, the, I don't like to ask women their body count because if it's less than, if it's anything more than zero, listen, that's just pissed me off. If it's anything more than zero, then it's like, bro, I, at the end of the day, I've heard women that said they had a body count with um, 15, and I've had women that said they were virgins, and they acted the same. Like, a lot of the time, I feel like body count, yeah, it matters, but it don't. Now, at the end of the day, let's get into some reasons, or uh, some ways you can counteract this, bro. I'ma just be real, bro. If you really want to know she's fucking with you for real, and she's not just using you for sex and all of that type shit, bro, you got to understand, bro. You have to you have to ask her for shit, bro. Like, bro, if you want that 2K25, you want the... If, shit you watching this next year and gta 6 came out tell that bitch to get you gta 6 like she has to show you some shit she has to show you that she fucks with you all right you like them new jordans tell that bitch i, I want them jordans you should buy me them jordans or something on some real shit like bro you i don't care if people in the comments say why are you scrounging off woman it's not scrounging off woman it's just like bro if you fuck with me and i want some shit shit bitch you should get that shit for me because if we fuck with each other i'm gonna do shit for you also 
it's not just some one way shit. It's not like I'm, you know, using her. It's like it's a side to show. Okay, damn, she actually got her credit card details out. She went online. She put her info in and she ordered them kits for me. Like that shit that matters to me. Like, bro, I'm not just out here gonna be giving a random. Like, bro, you gotta understand. I, I have a girl. Her friend DM me. Friend DM me trying to talk about. Oh yeah, if you was like she, they it was a setup. Like they tried to set me up. She was on the phone talking to me. Her friend was on the phone talking to me, talking about, oh, if I was in a bed with you right now, what would you, if I was with you right now, what would you do? I said, ma'am, I don't know you. See, when you conquered your lust and you don't really get too overexcited about sex and you realise sex is just a normal thing, like, it's not something we should fucking fantasise over or whatever, bro, you realise that, damn, none of these bitches can really use the pussy to, to, to go against you. And it's like, you have to understand whether you're dealing with a woman that wants you for sex or just she fucks for you. Bro, I'm gonna tell you right now, if you find a woman at the club nine times out of, nine times out of ten, she just wants to fuck. I'ma just be real, she's on some pump and dump shit. Like nine times out of ten, she don't really fuck with you. Like you can get a number. Nine times out of ten, if you find her at the club, she didn't go there with their attention. Don't let bitches um trick you. They don't go there with their attention. I'm just having a girl's night out with my friends, bro. No, you go in there to get attention in the hopes you get some good dick. Stop the cap. Stop the cap. You go into the club with the intention of looking good for men so hopefully they approach and one of them gets to dick you down. Let's just be real about that. Like, a club, vice versa. A lot of niggas, they go there to get pussy. Women go there to get dick. It's just, it is what it is, okay? That's why I said, like, bro, make her do shit. Like, bro, not every day you spending the money. Tell that, I like that jacket. Like, you gonna, babe, you gonna get me that jacket. I want that jacket right there on the, on the hang. I want that jacket, that jacket. I fuck with that jacket. And if she can do some real shit like that, that's kind of a sign that she, she's taking it a bit more serious than what an average girl. Because, bro, some of you bitches, you ask them to buy you some, you buy me the J's or whatever, they look at you crazy. But, bitch, you're the same hoe that would accept my dick every day of the week. So it's like, bro, you, you can't let, like, bro, as a black man, you, you're going to get objectified, bro. You're going to get obje objectified. A lot of women, a lot of white women especially, they're going to just look at you and think, BBC, BBC, with their eyes rolled back, like, BBC. They don't look at you like, oh, husband. No, a lot of them look at you like, damn, I, how, I wish I could experience him in bed. Nah, I'm not letting no woman use me for sex. Like, bro, if you don't serve a purpose, no. It, you don't You always get this dick for free. You don't always get this dick for free. It's only a few of my bitches, like, bro, if you Ice Spice, if you was Rihanna before the pregnancy on ASAP Rocky, whatever his name is, if you was, um, who else? Who else is a bad bitch? Like, if you was, what's her name? I forgot her name. I think it's, fuck, I forgot her name. But yeah, there's a lot of celebrities, y'all yeah, getting it for free. Some of them are sexy, but the average woman, bro, nah. If your intention is just, ah, oh, BBC, I want to use him for dick. And I'm cool with him. Like I felt like I've been used for dick multiple times, bro. I feel like bitches have been been using me for my dick multiple times, bro. And I don't like that feeling, bro. I'm not a fucking sex slave, bro. But that being said, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I'll be back with more content soon. Peace.